Here's another truck driving story. Back in the early 90s, I was rolling as a team driver and we're rolling down the 10 freeway going west. I think we were in between Phoenix and the state line going into California, somewhere in there. Wherever it was, I know it was hot as hell and the truck broke down. Back in the day, we had really raggedy trucks and that was before the condo days, I just say that. So it was a flat top. So we're rolling and the truck breaks down. So we're on a CB, I'm on a CB and my buddy is out outside trying to flag down trucks. We didn't think anybody was gonna stop. So we hear this voice over the CB, APST, you all right over there? So I get on the CB and I tell him, I say, uh, we broke down, the truck won't start. And he says, well, stay there, I'll flip a bitch, I'll come around, I'll get you guys, I'll take you to the next exit. So he come around, he get us, we grab our uh, water bottles and everything, cause we don't know why the truck won't start. So he come around and we're talking like, uh, when this guy comes around, what if he's like a killer or something like that? And you know, so we kinda don't wanna go but we don't want to be sitting there in that truck because it's like 100 plus degrees. So he came around. He actually came. So uh, he came around. I let my friend get in the truck first and he sat in the, in the uh, sleeper. I sat on the side seat there. He took us to the next exit, let us fill up the water bottles and get some uh, juice and some water and everything, food. And then uh, he took us back to the truck. Really was surprised. Um, there are some really nice <laughs> truck drivers out there, I guess. But uh, yeah, but there's this uh, scene in that Pee Wee Herman movie movie where this lady was driving a truck and Pee Wee Herman was kind of scared. And when he looked at her, she turned into a monster. That's what we were thinking. Probably. I don't know. CouchPotatoBud.com.